Well, Jonathan and Melinda, the accused in this case has been saddled with more than a half dozen felony criminal charges, and his bond is over a million dollars, so he won't be getting out of jail anytime soon. But that won't bring any comfort to this community who has lost a law enforcement officer. A memorial has been put in place, and the flags are being flown at half staff in East Montgomery County. That's after a death that has touched the entire community. This is a mayor's nightmare when you hear all the officers getting killed around the country and you have meetings with your officers, it's always like, please stay safe. I don't think I could bury one of you. And then here we are. State Police A Sergeant Stacy Bumgartner with Patton Village Police Department attempted to stop a driver who was wanted for urinating near a local convenience store Sunday afternoon. Police say that man, 29 year old Garrett William Knee of Kingwood, attempted to run down Bumgartner in his car when he arrived on the scene. When the veteran police officer pursued the man through a red light, investigators say Sergeant Bumgartner was T boned by a SUV, killing him and a 12 year old. Aiden Hilario, a passenger in that SUV. Five others were sent to the hospital. The difficulty for the community is going to be because they lost an officer that truly cared about them. There are so many citizens in this city that know Sergeant Baumgartner because he is a personable guy and he's personable. But he made himself known to his community. The death of Sergeant Bumgartner has taken a toll on Patton Village, where he's been on the force for four years. He's survived by a wife and two children, children who lost their dad on Father's Day. Local pastor Richard Hale in Patton Village. It's different, you know, when you're in a little town, it's hard when somebody gets killed. Obviously, you ran across him, you met him before? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm the pastor of the church up on the hill there. Mm -hmm. And he'd come by and visit me with me once in a while or with the other guys, yeah. As for the man investigators say caused this, Garrett William Knee, he's behind bars and he has a $1.3 million bond and a laundry list of charges to deal with. One of them is a felony murder charge for evading from the, the officer to begin with, uh, and it resulted in death of the officer. The other charges include intoxication, manslaughter. Uh, for the deaths and then intoxication assault times six for the other injuries to the other uh, victims in the vehicles. Now, GoFundMe pages have been set up before for the officer as well as a 12 year old kid in this case. Now, one of the things the mayor told me in Patton Village is that the wife of Sergeant Bumgartner, Donna, says, do not forget about the family and the civilians who were also hurt in this instance. They're also planning a vigil at some point, and they don't have the details as of yet, but once we get it, we'll bring it to you here on Fox 26. Reporting from Montgomery County, Isaiah Carey, Fox 26 News. Thank you.